Hello. This time we are going to take a look at question 201, bitwise and of numbers range. In this question, we're given a range m n, where m n is in the range of 0 to 21474836475. I think that's the maximum integer it can get and uh, we have to return the bitwise end of all numbers in this range inclusive to do this we can we can do it uh, as the um, problem describes like we we really do a bitwise operation of all the numbers in this range but that will be inefficient and we don't have to do it after we observe the pattern so the pattern is um, there is a position in the uh, bit form and uh, that uh, to the left of that position every number uh, every bit will be the same and to the right of that position every bits will be different but uh, the the after we do a bitwise operation to all those numbers the right part will only be zero. So the key point of our solution is to find out that position. So let's see how we can code it. Uh, but before that, let me uh, use an example so so you can understand what I'm saying. So for example, m is 20 and n is 24. And we have to find out uh, uh, the, those numbers from 20 to 24 21, 22, 23, 24 and 20, number 20 is 10001 and 0100 uh, and number 21 is 0001 and 0101 so you already see the pattern. So 0001 is always the same. So this is the position. So the first four bits is always the same and the last four bits is always different. But after we do a bitwise operation, they will become zero. Uh, so you can see um, after I finish this. So for example, there, keep going just uh, to illustrate this idea so you can see every column there is at least uh, one zero therefore the after you do a bitwise operation to all those numbers you eventually get a big zero so this question becomes a lot simplified so what what you need is to determine the position that and um, so to the right of that position every bit you just don't have to consider it you just uh, think that is zero because it's going to be zero after those operations and uh, and so the so the final result will be decided by the uh, first a few um, bits that's that's to the left of that position Okay, so we get the idea now. How do we code it? So first, we need a a count so we can know like what the position is, and then we use a while loop. When m is not equals to n, this while loop is going to uh, keep looping, and so how this is going to work is that m is always going to be and uh, uh, do a bit shift to the uh, left no sorry to the right and n is always going to do a bit shift to the oh no, sorry to the same direction as well and every time we do that we we add 
we increment our count so we know that um, uh, that position is is uh, what's the position then at the end when we return we always um, we get back the that position so we shift M or, or N that doesn't matter because they will share the same uh, first for uh, first few bits and we shift them to the left then all those number uh, all those number to the right of the position will be zero so the key point of this problem it is uh, we have to observe the pattern and find out mm, like eventually after we do all those bitwise operations so there will be a position so um, so to the right of this position every every bits will be zero so there's it's pointless to calculate them and to the left of the positions that's what matters and then so we only need to find out the right part which we don't we also don't need to calculate them because they are the same for for every number and uh, then we replace all those bits behind them to zero then we get the final result